Well, we the thing is, I, I, I do enjoy thinking about it. That's like trying to figure out, like, really, how does the emotion and matter interact that all this happens? Well, it's interesting because it happens so gradually that you cannot see it. And that's the thing that is confounding. This buffer of time. He, he, here's the best way that we can describe this to you. 99, more than 99% of every creation is completed vibrationally before you see any physical evidence of it. And the reason for that is your contrast causes you to launch it and then source adheres to it and becomes one with it. And then things begin to move into place to bring it to what you would call manifestation or physical fruition. So when you feel enthusiasm, when you get to that place where you're feeling really passionate about something, and when you think about it, it thrills you to think about it. It doesn't beat you up to think about it. You're right on the brink of manifestation. So you could do your own personal scientific survey where you start watching a timeline between things you feel pessimistic about and things you feel optimistic about and show yourself an absolute recordable ratio between how long it takes. Those things that you feel enthusiasm about happen fast and those things that you feel pessimistic about don't happen ever until you improve the way you feel. And what you begin to notice is that if you're feeling discouragement about something, then it's a, it's a long way, uh, so long that you could call it forever away. If you're feeling frustration about it, it's still not ready to manifest, but it could manifest quicker, but not until you close the gap. Nothing happens till you close the gap. So we don't care if you're in despair or in frustration or in even a feeling of slight hopefulness or pessimism. It's still not ready to manifest until you close the gap. So the question of time is, how long does it take me to move up this emotional scale? Because you got to close the gap before the manifestation is going to happen every single time. It's not going to manifest before you line up with it. It's not. It cannot. And that is traceable, trackable, definable, learnable, teachable, explainable. In other words, teach it to yourself and then you'll find a million different ways that you can teach it to others.